Hey guys, and welcome back to another episode of Stratos playing Subnautica. What just happened there? Uh, that... What, what, what was that? Okay, so it's in early access. Things are going to happen or whatever. I don't know what that was, but it, it happened. So, to get stuff going here, I need to get... Uh, let me show you real quick. Let me go back down into here. Let's see... Where we at? Where we at? Where we at? Here we go. Fabricator. Okay, so... They start doing anything really well. Pins, silicone rubber. Okay. Well, to really start doing stuff, I need a silicone rubber, which to get the survival knife, to get coral samples, to, so I can start getting, you know, uh, basic materials like this stuff here uh, filtered water, which requires air sacs or bleach. And to get bleach, you need to have coral samples and. Emergency. Severe yeah. dehydration. I'm going to dehydrate soon. Six I'm going to die. Uh, silicone rubber needs creep vine clusters, and then bleach is also needed coral samples. So I need to get silicone rubber to create the knife, and then from the knife, I can use to get coral samples. Uh, where'd it go? Where'd it go? To make the bleach. So I got that plus coral samples, blah, blah, blah. Um, now just to kind of survive. Uh, do I have any air? Oh, okay. So I got that left my Vital back. Uh, 28. That should be good for a little while. Let's go ahead and eat that. Now I'm healed. Or at least hunger proof, whatever. Uh, salt deposit, good. Check. I found out my storage. I got a lot of little things. I gotta figure out how to get through them. Um, I guess we'll go ahead and break down the metal salvage real quick. So it's, it's taking up so much space. Resources, basic, titanium. Alright. Although, I don't know if that really helped, because it really just added, uh, yeah, the titanium took up four slots. Alright, so, we need to go get clusters. And I had to look this up, because I wasn't finding them. Alright, okay. Clusters come from these seaweed things here. But over here by the seaweed things, of course, is these meat-eating, hungry-looking things down there at the bottom. Which are kind of scary. So, I'm going to see if I can maybe get to one of these ones over here on the edge. Away from that big fish with the chirp teeth. Hopefully that goes okay, and then once we get that, I can probably come back and get the knife and start harvesting those coral shell things to get samples. Okay. Oh crap, I think those cluster, those are the cluster things right there, those little glowy things. air tank I put over here is over here and then the second one which still counts towards my air is right here oh we only got four creep lines but they take up so much space and I've got so much titanium I need more storage space all right so we got this dehydration detected thank you uh I'm, no we don't need lubricant we need rubber there we go we've got the rubber uh knife check we've got a knife all right so we've got the knife. Um, let's go ahead and escape. Well, not really escaping. All right. So we got the knife. Oh man, I can just slice and dice you. Come here, fishy. I won't hurt you much. All right. So coral samples should be like. There we go. Hit tab. Okay, we got three. Let's go ahead and get some more. How many do we got now? Uh, let's see here. Six, eight, okay, we got eight. Let's go ahead and take this back. We got our salt deposit, I think, hope so. Who are you laughing at? All right. All right, there we go. Let's get up from there. Let's get back into crafting. Okay, uh, basic bleach. Alright, we've got our bleach, got our substance, disinfected water. Yeah, yeah. Alright, now let's see how much that actually helped us. Get this open and straight. Alright, so now we're up to 55. So that's good. That actually gave us a lot of water. Um, that'll be helpful, so I'll have enough time to go back down there and get more. But we need more rubber. Come on, rubber. There we go. Alright, so the next thing I wanted to do was flippers. Oh, I need one more silicone rubber. 
And of course, I'm sure to get the more rubber, I need two more clusters. And that's really all I have space for is two more clusters. Alright, let's go back down. Let's go get ourselves some clusters. Alright, we're back. So we've got our silicon rubber. It is now crafted, yes. Alright, personal equipment flippers. So hopefully this will help us swim a whole lot faster. Um, let's go over here. They're already on. Okay, translates, vertical movement, blah, blah, blah. Okay, good. Alright, now what should we do next? Um, Asian suit. Yes. Um, reclaim some moisture from the body. Huh. And then thermometer, okay. That could be helpful. Uh, tools, tools, tools. Air bladder. Buoyancy, huh. Okay. Habitat bladder. So we need this guy, I believe. Computer chip and a battery. Start making the big containment things that I wanted. So I was hoping to do that now, but apparently I am way off. So, which makes sense, I mean. Alright, so bleach, lubricant, magnesium, gas, plus steel, electronics, here we go, copper wire, battery, uh, power cells, computer chip, which requires two table coral samples, silver ore, quartz. And I haven't found anything like metal wise. Uh, so this may take some time to actually find that stuff. Um, At least we know how to get to it. Um, water. Yeah, we're gonna have to get some more salt and more core samples. Oh no, we got plenty of core samples right now, but we do need more salt. And I'm kind of curious if I can stab some of these fishies. Here, I'll get you a little purple one. Boomerang fish. Got him. Holy crap, this here. He's chasing a fish into my area. Get out. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. Alright. I don't know what to do with you, dude. Really? Um, cook food? What did that just do? Cooked, uh, picked up, cooked air sack. Um, what does that do? Where are we at? This guy will provide four, four water and 16 food. Uh, spongy, okay. Eat him. Okay, did exactly what I thought he'd do. Alright, so we know we can cook him up. Uh, let's see here, cook, and then we got the boomerang fish, uh, good eating all around, hardly fins, carrot feud, um, some jerky, uh, but we need salt for that too. I guess if you cure it though, it probably does a lot better job of it. Oh, don't you attack me. Yeah, you better run. Go. Oh gosh. There you are. Oh. I've just like sliced you like three times. Oh gosh, that hurt. Oh gosh. Where's he at? Oh gosh. Alright, uh, med kit. Alright, can we get back up? Can we get back up? Uh, Alright, can we go back in? Uh, is there another med kit in here? Yes, alright. Alright, um, use? Okay, we're back. 
Does this guy give infinite medkits? Medkit fabricator. Uh oh. Maybe it's worn every so often. Where are you at? Alright, bring it on. I wonder what we're gonna get for this. If we can. Maybe I don't have enough tools. Does it show his health at all? That'd be kind of neat. What is, what is happening? So I think I killed him. It gave me the items already, like it kind of glitched out a little bit. Because I'm not getting anything else from... And it says there's a heat signature, 444 meters there, and it's blinking. Um, oh, whew, scare me again. again. Um, I don't know what that means. I want more salt, though. Definitely need more salt. I wish I had a flashlight. That could be handy. What do you do? Um, can I pick you up now? Oh, your table coral. Okay. Now I know what that is. Salt, and I can't find any. All right, guys, I'm gonna go hunting for salt. All right, guys, I'm back. So if you kind of noticed, I was running around, swimming around, trying to figure things out. Got attacked by uh, that, you know, sharp tooth thing there. Kind of ventured off trying to find salt deposits. Couldn't find anything. But the bonus here is now that I got flippers, I can swim boat faster, and I figured something out here that you probably just saw right at the end. When going into here, there's a fish that you can catch. It's a little bit easier than others. Um, it's this thing right here. It's called an air sack. But you can use that air sack right here. Look at that. You catch him, it creates oxygen, and that fills me up pretty nice. Um, I only had caught two of those, and it got myself up to 50, or I guess that's, it's not really, it's called an air sack, but it, I guess it creates purified water. Um, but yeah, so I've gotten two of those right now, and it's just these guys right here, and look at that. So easy to catch. I'm going to grab this guy too while I'm at it. Did I get him? No, I don't think so. Let's go ahead and switch back to my knife. Where'd you go? Here's someone. Come on, come on. And really, I mean, just to catch them is if so as you're starting to get close, just kind of like smash the clip, the left button key, or left mouse, left mouse button. And as soon as you get it over it and you're close enough, you'll pick them up like that. These guys, I can't even get close to. Uh, I did manage to, to get another boomerang on accident once. Uh, but I don't even know if you can pick these guys up. Oh, 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 oh. I don't know. Maybe you can. Maybe later on once I get more stuff. But obviously, these guys are going to be your best bet. You want to get those flippers and come after these guys. Because I have not been finding any salt. Like, I found, you know, the original few deposits. But I have not seen any new pop up. Not even, like, in the spots I normally, where I found the last ones. So I don't know how long it takes for that stuff to reappear or anything like that. But it didn't. Anyways, another thing I kind of, I grabbed, or was able to grab, was this. Now these cost, you know, I forget how much titanium, but I went ahead and made two of them, and now I've got little storage lockers just kind of floating out here. Granted, I wish it was somewhere where they were maybe inside, but we don't have that luxury yet because we don't have a little base. Um, and the other thing is, too, I killed one of the sharp guys. Ten oh. seconds of okay, oxygen oxygen. Remaining. That's nice. Let's go up here. I wanted to show you this real quick. So while I was fighting, uh, it glitched out a little bit fighting that, you know, the big sharp tooth guy. But open up tab here, and I got some items from it. I got some food. Uh, well, I got some of these. I got a nutrition block. I got bottled water and something else from him. Uh, but this is what I got too. I got this thing called a signal. 
uh, coordinates heat signature and left mouse button on click whatever it automatically put it in there because I didn't have anything in there now and that popped up that thing right there so that heat signature whatever it is that signal is telling me what that is and that's the only one I guess that's the closest one in the area right now but what is I seeing things you see that thing blinking okay anyway see we make countries over there you can see it's kind of green I guess as you get closer to that ship, radiation is going to increase, so we're going to need radiation suits. But, here we go. So, we've got this. I killed one of those guys. I didn't get anything from it. Maybe you don't get items every single time you kill something big. Or maybe I need something special for killing him. Um, I did happen to find another creature egg. Let's go ahead and put that in one of our boxes. Let's see. Alright, uh, pick up. No. you in, get a bunch of these coral samples in there, freeing up a lot of our own space here, we don't need the fire signature really right now, so we'll go ahead and throw them in there, use fires and check, okay. alright, so, but well, we need these air sacks, so let's go ahead, and let's go back up in here, and I don't know why, but I always turn that one, water, and there we go, let's go ahead and craft all those up. just about it. Here we go. Oh, Alright. Uh, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Look at that. Food, water, A, we are all at max. Alright, so you know what? I say we go and venture for that heat signature. We got our water meters up, our hydration, whatever. So, let's go down into the spooky cave. I don't have a flashlight, anything like that, but... Figure things out. Let's go. Ooh, look at this guy. Can I pick him up? New creature discovered. Hey, I picked him up. Now it did recommend earlier. Oh, come on, come on. New creature gotcha. discovered. Um, that when you you should use a scanner before picking things up. Uh, I guess there's gonna be things out here that you pick up and they might do something bad. Um, I get the feeling I'm going to stumble onto something that explodes. Like, oh, there it is. Oh gosh, oh gosh. Ow. Ow, ow, ow. Um, do you leave anything behind? Oh, you do. So, you leave the crash powder behind if you don't blow up. Or, well, if you do blow up. Um,. Thirty seconds of oxygen remaining. Of oxygen. Let's go. Oh. Kind of creepy at night. I don't have a flashlight. I think a flashlight's going to be a, a must. Oh man. So that's the other thing too. Is these cow things, although they're kind of like harmless, they don't choose after you. They release those little yellow light, little spore things, and from there, those guys will draw uh, detonated clouds, which will actually damage you. So let's go in here. What did we learn? Uh, let's see, you don't do anything for us. Uh, pepperfish, cooked pepper, okay. Uh, cooked grayfish. Oh, that's the first guy we got. I'm also I'm curious if they help out in any other way. I don't see anything. Maybe later on. I don't know. Let's go ahead and we'll. Let's go ahead and cook these guys up. That is one creepy looking fish. Huh. We got two? See this guy. Food. So their food 
really isn't that great. Um, dairy fish. Just because. Wait, did it go down? So it looks like cooked pepper, or peeper. I don't know why I keep calling pepper. Uh, great for food. H2O, 4. I could have sworn that said 13. I wonder if they degrade. Um, but we got that. Okay. Go ahead and eat that. Eat it, eat it. Alright. We're at 100%. Good to go. We got that back up. Should be able to pick another one up here. There we go. Alrighty. Um, I don't know what that did. Okay. Um, so we really didn't get a whole lot done here. We did figure out a few things, how to make water, or how to make drinkable water. Um, you know, how to catch the fish, get the flippers, how to get to the rubber. All that kind of fancy stuff. So it looks like every time we pick up a new fish, we'll unlock new recipes. Um, who knows what they're for. Um, so I'm definitely going to have to track down to tools. Uh, computer chip and battery. Which comes to this. Battery, got that. We need copper ore. And a it's battery and computer chip needs server ore quartz. And table core sample times two. So we know how to get the table core. We don't know how to get the copper and ore. So I think we'll leave that for the next episode, guys. Thanks for watching. If you haven't already, go ahead and give me that thumbs up. And uh, if you guys would like, go ahead and subscribe and uh, keep a lookout for future episodes. Until next time, I'm Stratus, and you guys have a nice day.